How's it going, everybody? My name is Udarvis, and today we are playing the new Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD with the Skyward Sword Joykins. Let's just giddy on up. I'm going to turn this up to 50 because I feel like it. I can always turn it down later. Let's begin this incredible adventure. I'm ready. You're ready. I might have to take my shirt off in about 20 minutes. Now then, I don't know how much of that y'all saw, but let's begin. Let's freaking do it. I'm going to move this slightly and then there we go. All right. We are... Going. This is a tale that you humans have passed down through uncounted generations. It tells of a war unmatched, of unmatched scale and ferocity, the likes of which you've never seen. One dark, fateful day, the earth cracked wide. Malevolent forces rushed forth from the something, the darkness, probably. They mounted a brutal assault upon the surface. People driving their land, the something. They burnt forests to ash, choked the land's sweet springs, and murdered without hesitation. All these shadow demons sure don't look too good. They did all this in their lust to take the ultimate power, protected by her grace, the goddess. The goddess. The power she guarded was without equal. Handed down by the gods of old, this power gave its holder the means to make any desire a reality. Such was the might of the ultimate power that the old ones placed it in the care of the goddesses to prevent this great power from falling into the hands of the evil swarming the lands. The goddess gathered the surviving humans on an outcropping of earth and she ejaculated it into the sky. <laughs> she sent it skyward beyond the reach of the demonic hordes, beyond even of the of the, the whores? Yeah, the whores. Those blasted whores. You know, what the, jeez, what the humans say, the goddess joined forces with the land dwellers and fought, I can't read fast enough. At last, peace was restored to the surface. You know, it's quite loud. You can, pro you can probably hear it. This is a tale that you humans have told for many ages, generation to generation. <laughs> but there are other legends long hidden away from memory that are intertwined with this tale. Now, a new legend bound to this great story stands ready to be revealed. A legend that will be forged by my own hand. My own hand. Incredible. All right, give me some demons to chop up, man. I'm ready to go, man. Oh, it looks so nice. Everybody take a deep breath of me. Listen to the wind. You feel a calming sense. the sounds point joy con right at the screen where is the screen the screen is down here i guess that's not good this is the screen though the screen
probably play like this. Okay. Should I just go with Link or should we do me? Uh, I mean, I usually play as just Link. But this is the legend of Judarvis, baby. This is Judarvis time. You know what? Nah, I'm a basic bitch. Ah! Oh. I'm a basic bitch. Am I, though? I kind of am. I just like Link. I like Link. 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 Yeah, I'll just go with Link. <clears throat> Sorry guys, I'm basic, I know it's... Big boobs. It's like, uh... It's like, uh, the hills have mouths. It's like the distant sequel. It also looks exactly like if one of the Mario hills was evil and had a mouth instead of eyes with shadow demons all around it. That's kind of what it looks like as well. The Legend of Zelda. Skyward Sword. The sword that is Skyward Oh, it's so cool. Everybody jump off to your deaths. Die. Here, eat this letter for me, please. Thanks. All right. Bye-bye now. See you later, big bird. fated to have a hand in a great destiny and it will soon find you time has come for you to awaken link having a nightmare a giant bird capable of eating me was just like oh, wake up <laughs> that's like the scene from attack on titan but like with birds isn't that based on a real bird i don't remember what the bird is thanks for the letter bro sro is that it S bro Hey, sleepyhead. I know how much you like to sleep in, so I'm guessing this letter will be your alarm clock this morning. Did I guess right? Rise and shine, Link. Today's the wing ceremony. You promised to meet me before it starts, remember? <laughs> We're gonna smash. Smash, bro. You better not keep me waiting. Zelda. It's probably not what she sounds like at all, but that's, you know. That's like <gasps> oh, look at smiling boy. All right. How do I roll? It's always the first thing to learn. 
is how to bash her head into shit. Pick up the pots. That's like your thing. Ugh. Sit. Stand. Read this. I can't read. That's unfortunate for me, considering all these books in here. I have no need for them. You found a blue rupee. It's worth five rupees. Better drop it in your wallet for now. Wait, no, I want to look at that. That's like... There's nothing useful in here. There's clearly many things. Like a feather. There's a bag. There's what looks like a wooden dildo. That's useful. It'd be useful when I go meet Zelda later. You know? <laughs> Can I roll yet? Hey there, uh, Pippin. Is that isn't that your name? Isn't that your name? Yeah. There's Pippin. Pip it. So close. I remember this back when I played it. Like, <laughs> when did this come out on the Wii? Ten years ago, probably. I don't know. So today's the wing ceremony. Are you ready? All I'm saying is everyone else is out practicing at the plaza, but you seem pretty relaxed about the whole thing. Of course, that crimson loft wing of yours is something special. I'd feel pretty confident riding him too. My bird won the last ceremony, but even I don't think he could beat that red terror of yours. Of course, a bird's true speed in a race always comes down to the skill of the rider. I'm something of a bird researcher around here, so if you know, so you know, if you ever find yourself in need of some, <laughs> if you ever find yourself in need of some bird expertise, come and see old Pippin. Hmm. If you need to know, oh, I got you. What is this? Erase it. Karain plus Ka. No ru No running in the holes! Mm. Olin, you look like you're gonna eventually become the Rito people. Hey Link, the day of the wing ceremony is finally upon us. It's time to put what you've learned to use. All those practical skills I taught you and all the uh, academic prowess instructor Horwell taught you. While we're at it, do you remember how to look around using... Press when you want to take a look at your surroundings. Whoa. Woo. Oh God. Oh, it's a, uh, it's, it's motion controlled. Why would this, that is horrible. It's so sensitive. No, wait. Is it even possible to not just like, I guess you can look, you can look around a lot. Always dive from a designated platform when mounting your loft wing in Skyloft. Thanks for the information. Can I roll yet? Run. Pledge. Of course, Fledge. Wow, everybody's just so rude. Wait, all these doors are locked. Does that mean this is a horror game? I didn't read what she said. I wanted to fly too, but I, I didn't make the cut. So I'm stuck back here at the academy. Plus, I've got to move these barrels over to the kitchen. I was hoping to at least be able to chew you on, Link. But I guess that's the way it goes. Go out there and wow them, buddy. <laughs> you got it, dude. A pot to smash. Aw, oh, I'm too much of a baby. Where in the clouds is that fledge boy? He's supposed to be bringing me barrels. Sometimes I just don't know what's going on in that boy's head. Like... These kinds of barrels.
Yeah, 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 yeah. What if I just come take his barrels? I'm better than you, Fledge. You suck. <laughs> I'm so strong. Oh, I'm gonna time it. Don't you worry, you're pretty little lad. I can make it. I can make it. Watch this, watch this, watch this. I can make it! Made it. What's all this? I thought I told Fledge to carry that. Bah! Bah! It's probably for the best. That skinny boy would probably have gotten flattened. Say, don't you have some important ceremony or some such today? <laughs> well, thanks for the help. No problem. What if I just go steal the other barrel? Because Fledge is such a... <laughs> Fledge is such a loser. <sighs> thanks, that was a huge help. It was not much. Here's half. What if I just... I have to hang back and watch the Academy today. Good luck with this ceremony. What if I just take your other one? I'll just, yeah. Yeah. No, don't help or anything. Just watch. You cretin. Just, yeah. You stay in the corner where you belong. I can make it. I can make it. You're welcome. All right, now give me the rest of your allowance that you were supposed to have, because you suck. Oh, I did that for no reason. Okay, you know what? That's fine. That's fine. Break it. That's like your thing. Throw it. Listen, the, we all know... Hey! Hey! Link! If you're headed over to the plaza, the quickest way is out the door on the ground floor. The exit on the top floor is still locked, so obviously you can't get out there. What's taking the lunch lady so long? I'm going to have a word with her later. Listen, I'm big boss around here. Don't disrespect me. I gotta take a giant shit, bro. Hell yeah. Nice, nice dumpies. Clean hands or happy hands. Clean your damn hands, Link. You disgusting creep. Can I roll yet? Do I just not know how to roll in this game? How do... I can't do anything. Save. And now we are locked in to progress. Hey, hey, Link, up here. Yo. Good morning to ya, Link. Today's finally the day of the long-awaited wing ceremony. Are you feeling ready? Oh, I just remembered. There's something I'd like to ask you about. Target me! Shoot me in the head! So I can leave this blasted and painful existence. And we can have a quick chat. Ooh. Excellent! Always remember, you can target someone to kill them. 
or to talk to someone easily. And when there isn't anything to target, it's a convenient way to quickly face your view forward. Oh, but it's a little silly to carry on a conversation from this distance. Why don't you come join me up here? I'm sure you can figure it out. Yeah, I got it. 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 Thanks. I got it. No, I know how to do it. I've already done it. Oh, God. I almost jumped off the entire planet. Can I just do that? Can I just kill myself right now if I just do that? Oh, I can't. I can't do it. All right. That's, they, uh, you know, they have a, they have a fail safe. That's good. That's good. <laughs> Woohoo! Yeah! Woohoo! No. So, what are you up to? Rushing to get some last minute bird riding practice on this morning, Link? Oh? You have someone to meet? <laughs> Zelda's waiting for you, is she? No. No. Perfect timing then. You see, Zelda's father, Headmaster Gaipora, has a pet named Mia. And, well, she's scampered off again. Look, you can see her through your omniscient vision. <laughs> Look, over there, do you see her? The headmaster is so busy working with Zelda preparing for the ceremony. I thought that maybe I should feed her, but the ceremony is about to start and I just put on a fresh set of clothes and well, you see, will you help me out and go retrieve Mia for me? I'm on it. It's fantastic. So you'll do it? I know you're in a hurry. So I really appreciate your taking the time to help. You should be able to climb up somewhere over there. If you hang off that ledge there, you can climb onto the roof from the other side. I'm terribly sorry, but I know you're quite the climber. I really do appreciate it. No problemo, my man. No problemo. Oh, let me just do some wall humping. Oh, that's nice. Getting close. I'm real close. All right, I'm there. Yeah. What the hell was that? Oh my God, I forgot. I forgot. I forgot. <sighs> I forgot how atrocious the camera angle is in this game. Oh God. Oh, I can't make that. Can I just jump it? <gasps> oh, you just reach your stubby. All right, we're almost there now, boys. What was that thing? Oh, I see. Hey, <laughs> Run. Gotcha. Now throw her off the edge. Nice work. You brought her back safe and sound. Sorry for troubling me with this. I know you're busy, Link. I suppose I should feed Mia now. It's probably why she ran away in the first place. Please tell the headmaster that we found his pet. He should be up by the statue of the goddess. Oh, really? I believe Zelda is there with him, so you should hurry along. I don't remember. I can't hear my own voice because it's so loud. You know what? I'm going to do this. I should give you a reward. It's not much, but please take this. Or don't tell the others. Can I roll yet? I cannot roll yet. <laughs> Woohoo! Hello there, Elvis. You look like. Ooh. Oh gosh! You look like if Space Dandy was a pedophile. <laughs> if, I'm, if I'm being honest here. Figured you might be tossing and turning all night thinking about the big ceremony today. What am I doing? Oh, just fixing this gate here. 
It's been squeaky lately, and we can't have that on the day of the ceremony. Hey, you haven't already forgotten to send your prayers to the goddess this morning, have you? Just face the bird statue over there and say a short prayer to save your progress. As you know, these bird statues are all over Skyloft. It's about time you get in the habit of stopping at a statue every time you run by one. <laughs> That's not the voice I had for your laugh at all. A prayer in time saves saves nine, if you know what I'm saying. If you know what I'm saying. I got some. <laughs> I've got some ghost semen. <laughs> That's kind of <laughs> what it looks like. You got a stamina fruit. This peculiar fruit replenishes your stamina, gosh. The stairs of destiny. I can't roll up them. Truly a travesty. Listen, man, I'm a climber. We've already established this. Ah, uh, whatever. Ooh, I can climb this. I can't. I cannot. Apparently, I cannot. All right, let's get this show on the road. Let's get this a show on the road. My one gripe, and like, you know, it's cool, whatever, the Crimson Loftwing, yeah, but they're like, the Crimson Loftwing is so cool and rare, and I'm like, really, man, red is such a basic color. And I like red, all right, but, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Good morning, honey. Ready to have sex? <laughs> Good morning, Link. I'm glad to see my Loftwing got you out of bed. I was pretty sure you'd sleep in and forget to meet me this morning. <laughs> <laughs> but look at this instrument and look at this outfit. They're mine to use today in the ceremony, since I'll be playing the role of the goddess. Aren't they beautiful? Especially this instrument. They tell me it's just like the one the goddess was said to have in the legends. It sounds gorgeous too. I asked father about it. He calls, he says it's called a harp. <laughs> <laughs> and look at these clothes. I made this wrap myself and we get to use it in today's ceremony between this harp between the harp and this outfit. I'm going to make a great goddess today. I got you up early this morning because I wanted you to be the first to see me like this, Link. Oh, look at this. You guys are so cute. When are you going to bone? I'm serious. So, how do I look? Ah! Hey! What? Did you? Did, I, 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 I clicked. You little. You little. Come on, you little. God, I, I, I clicked it. You all saw it. It just went bloop. And what exactly is that supposed to mean, you goof? If you think I look silly, just come out and say it. Ooh. What? Aha! <laughs> there you are, Zelda. Are you all prepared for today's ceremony? Oh, hello, Father. Oh, Link, you're here too. <laughs> Outstanding. Do you like my horseshoe unibrow? I've worked on it quite hard. It's encouraging to see you up so early, given your capacity for sleep. No doubt today's ceremony had you too excited to close your eyes for once. That's probably mm. true. 
If you win today's ceremonial race, you'll forget you'll get to participate in the post-race ritual with Zelda. So give it your best out there. <laughs> yes, about that. Father, I don't know if he can do it. Recently, Link hasn't been practicing much at all for the ceremony. And even when he's out riding his loft wing, he's just lazily gliding around, probably daydreaming. I don't know what he's thinking. He's going to have to be in perfect control of his bird to win today. No need to worry yourself, Zelda. Though you may have a point, today's wing ceremony tests the skills of the rider as well as his, as his bond to his bird. Victory will not come easily. Hmm. And as you pointed out, I haven't seen him practicing as hard as some of the other students. That's because I don't need it. I'm literally the chosen hero across time and space. I don't need it. All right. I'm just like basically a god. I'm a living god. I'm above all you mortals. But you've known him since you were both very little. You should know better than to fret about him. You see, Link and his loft wing share a special connection. I've never seen anything quite like it. Speak of the devil. Here he comes now. As you know, each of us in Skyloft is but one half of a pair. We are only made whole by our loft wings. The guardian birds that the goddess bestows upon each of us as a symbol of her divine protection. When we are young, every one of us meets our loft wing under the great statue of the goddess. It's quite a big moment, as I'm sure you will recall. Ah, oh, but that first meeting between Link and his loft wing was extraordinary. The bird that came to him was a crimson loft wing. It is a breed so rare, we were sure for some time that it had vanished from the line. Yes, and the boy and his bird seemed to share a profound connection from the moment they met. <laughs> Do you recall when Link and that laughing of his first met? What a sight. The little boy just hopped up on that bird and gracefully flew away without even a moment of instruction. They were meant for each other. And judging by how jealous you were that day, I'd say the friendship he shared with his bird didn't go unnoticed by you, my dear. Who can blame you? I'm sure the only one envious of the powerful bond shed by Link and his bird. Anyone who is a part of something special is bound to catch some nasty looks sooner or later. Ho ho! Hoo hoo! I'm an owl now. He got it! I just now got it! Gapora! The bird from Ocarina of Time! Gapora Gabora! The owl! He lit. Duh! Hoo hoo! That's a, that's a, that's a clever nod! Clever, clever nod! Clever nod. This contest is nothing to laugh at, father. Oh wait, that's, sorry, sorry, Zelda, when did you become so manly? This contest is nothing to laugh at, father. This ceremony is part of the final test for those training to become Knights of Skyloft. If Link doesn't fly fast enough during the race, what if Link messes up his big chance? What if he's not allowed to become a knight? Ooh. Calm down, my dear. It will be fine. Honestly, it's almost as though you became you become a completely different person when you worry about Link. But I love him. Hey. Listen, Link. You'd better fly your heart out today. At the very least, you need to squeeze in a little bit of practice time before the race. <gasps> Help me! She's gonna... Come on, you'll thank me later. Listen. Okay. Here we are. Go on! 
Go on now, jump off the edge and call your loft wing. It's almost time for the ceremony. So try to practice seriously for once. Hmm? Oh yeah? You can't sense your bird out there? I didn't say that. My bird, like, right underneath this, this pavilion, bro. He's, got, he's gonna literally just eat you as soon as I jump off. Oh, I get it. You're trying to weasel out of having to practice. Nice try, but you're not fooling me. Now, die! <laughs> this is Spark! This is Skyloft! Okay, Link, go ahead and press Queen! This bird sure is taking a long time to get here. <laughs> Something's wrong! Oh god! My bird just clearly hates me. Or is he's probably like he probably I'll get some some bird <laughs> You know what I'm saying, get some bird -dussy. <laughs> Lots of things. Oh. Are, you, are you two all right? Oh boy! I almost died and shit my pants. I, actually, I did shit my pants. Sorry, I'm gonna need to change my pants. Because it's cold brown. I'm sorry, friend. I didn't mean to push you so hard. You didn't sprain your wing, did you? Mm -hmm. This is very odd, Link. What could have possibly happened to your loft wing? For a bird to ignore the call of his master, it's unheard of. You still can't sense your bird nearby, eh, Link? This is quite a problem, especially considering the wing ceremony is about to start. Link, when you said you couldn't sense your loftling, well, I should have believed you. I'm sorry. I need to tend to my own loft wing, so I'll catch up with you later. You better go on ahead and see if you can find where your bird has gone. I know where he is. I don't know where he is, but I know who did where he is. Because he's a sneak. Ooh. Mm. My, how did it get to be so late? If I recall correctly, this year, Instructor Horwell is presiding over the ceremony. Link. You should go explain the situation to him and see if he's willing to delay the race a little so that you can find your bird. Yes, sir. I had a, a, a father, I had a dad. But father, you're the headmaster. But father, you're the headmaster of the academy. If Link asks Horwell, he'll probably just come talk to you about it. Oh, oh. Ha! Oh, ho, ho! Ah, oh, quite true. As you, you make an excellent point, my dear. Very well. I'll explain the situation to him myself. Link, run along and tell Instructor Horwell to come see me in my quarters. Now, if you guys couldn't tell, they were using environmental clues to not only say, oh, this bird is sad, but they were also saying that my bird is over there in that cave. That's why they looked at it. Hmm. Don't worry, Link. I'll be... Sure to explain your predicament to Instructor Horror. Go find him and ask him to meet me in my quarters. While we chat, why don't you go ask some of the other students about your bird? I seem to recall a few of them were gathered near the plaza. Down at the south of Skyloft, that place with the X mark is the plaza. We'll be holding the wing ceremony there today. Bloop. I cannot... Man, this thing is real sensitive. Oh, I need to... There we go. The plaza. Mm. Have you read a map before? You can press minus. You can press at any time to see a map of the area. Remember, press. I feel like, what if characters were like, what are you, wh minus, what is that? I don't know what the hell that is. What am I doing? What did he just tell me to do? I was not listening. So, why do I need that? I don't need that. Let's just do this. I can probably just jump there from here if I'm just smart about it, right? There's something in this bush. 
All right. As we oh, he was just saying minus to activate my uh, my map. Need some ground fruit. Let's do this. We ah! That was an accident. Watch your step there. You can't always depend on knights like me to sweep in and save you. Kite. Thanks, Kite. He's got a cool coat. Ha! Thanks, Kite. It was uh, that was just speed run tactics. All right. I'm I'm curious. I'm gonna go back in my own spare time later and see if I can give <laughs> Zelda that compliment or if I like messed up the thing. Yo. What's wrong, Link? What's wrong, Link? You're looking a little pale. What? What? Your loft wing is missing. How strained and troubling. Do you think you can find him? You're going to start looking for him now? How you make it back in time to fly the ceremony? Looks like your participation in the ceremony hinges on feather. On, hinges on a feather or not. You can find that hmm. bird or time. Oh. Hinges on feather or not, you can find that bird in time. So, I see. So the headmaster has summoned me? All right. Then, I'll go speak with him immediately. I still owe you for helping me out earlier. So don't worry about the ceremony for now. You focus on finding your lost wing. Karain, don't men open doors for lady anymore? How am I supposed to stand here waiting for a little chivalry? Uh, hmm? Oh, it's you, Link. Say, you look all flustered. Did something happen? What? You can't find your loft wing? Uh, I don't know what to tell you. I've been here at school the whole time. <laughs> look at this absolute Chad. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it again. The absolute Chad. Ah! <laughs> After literally overhearing it, Link, based Link, Link does not give a shit, dude. Let's go take a shit, actually. Wait, this is the bathtub. Can I crouch? I can't crouch. Oh, oh, I was gonna go snoop through Zelda's room. What am I doing here? I have no reason to be here. Why did I come in here? I can't run in the halls. No running in the halls. Did you fix the gate yet? Huh? Is something wrong? Is some? What's my voice for him? I, I need to make it better than what I had. Is something wrong? What's the big hurry? What? Your loft wing is missing. But I just saw him. Bruce's bird was chasing off after your feathered fella. Which way? Uh, I think, uh, well, to be honest, I don't really know where they went. Well, then where's Groose? Uh, we got more questions? Groose! Oh, Groose and his little cronies were saying they were headed down to the wing ceremony in the plaza. So my guess is they might be in the plaza. Normally, the fastest way there is just down this path. But this gate here still needs some work before it'll open. Can you go around through the academy? Remember to check the map with minus if you get lost. Open the gate. Open the gate. Yeah. Open the gate. No, can I just leave? Save. <laughs> Big butterfly. Huh? We exploring. <laughs> Oh, I go ask this 
child. Hello, child. Hi. Thank you. Hi, Link. This is this how? What house? This house belongs to Kukil. By the way, that's me. I'm gonna go play with my special friend today. It's gonna be so much fun. Who's your special friend? Hey, Mama. Hi. Ho ho, Mama. Whoa, Mama. Hi, Link. Nice breeze today, huh? Perfect for the ceremony. So who do you think will win today? I guess Groose is a strong contender, but the winner will get, will get blessed <laughs> by a village girl chosen to represent the goddess. How romantic. It's gonna be me. I'm gonna win. Why am I saving again? I've done nothing. Heat. Hey Link, how's it going? The wing ceremony is about to begin, right? Remember when Pippet won the last one right at the last second? It was so close. Now, that was a race. Hey, your Crimson Loftwing will be in the race, right? I'm looking forward to seeing what he can do. Apparently, oh, I gotta come kill these guys because I hate them. You know, Grace. That sure was a pain, what with all the scratching and pecking. <laughs> of course it was. You thought a big Crimson Loft wing like that was going to go down without a fight? What's up, Patrick Warthers? <laughs> but uh, we got him. I don't care how tough those birds are supposed to be. He's not getting out of that pen anytime soon, boys. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Link! So, uh, just how long have you been standing there? <laughs> What's your problem, anyway? Oh, wait. I got it. Here to talk about today's race. I can see it in those dopey eyes of yours. They're pleading. Oh, Groose, can you please find a way? Find it in your heart to let me win today? Please? You're just so desperate to win so you can get some alo- Wait. You're just so desperate to win so you can get some alone time with Zelda up on the statue of the goddess at the end of the ceremony. <laughs> well, sorry, pal. Groose doesn't do charity for wimps. My advice? Work hard and wish with all your heart. You might even come in second. Say, come to think of it, how come I don't see your bird? Where is that scruffy pile of red feathers? I can't imagine what could have happened to him. Do you think his tiny brain got confused by all the claws and got lost? Bring it on. <laughs> sure. Only thing is, I don't know how you're going to do that with no bird. You going to grow wings? You know, we're all getting tired of how you never let anyone forget you and Zelda go way back. You've been friends since you were kids. Big deal. Doesn't change the fact that you float through life with your head in the clouds. Would you wake up, straighten up, and grow a backbone already? Dopes like you are dragging our honored academy through the mud. <laughs> and just who might you be talking about, Groose? Oh. Oh, Zelda! Hey, nah, it's, uh... <laughs> Don't even try it, Groose. You're picking on Link again, aren't you? He's a student at the Academy, like all of us. Why do you insist on bullying him around so much? Yeah, I s suppose. <laughs> you suppose? Suppose what? I suppose. <laughs> Forget it. I wasn't supposing anything, okay? <laughs> well, we're out of here, boys. Later, Link. Hope you find your bird, or else you're gonna have to sit out today's race. That could be a major setback toward knighthood. So find that bird, or get real used to the taste of failure. It's your special flavor. It's your special flavor. I think it's what I said. Probably. 
Your two lackeys are so ugly, bro. I hate to say it, but I'm beginning to suspect that those blockheads had something to do with your Loftwing's disappearance. Link, those guys aren't going to help us find your bird, so we'd better start searching. I'll fly around Skyloft and see if I can spot any trace of your bird. I know where he is. Father said he'd talk to Instructor Horwell about delaying the start of the wing ceremony, so don't worry. We'll find your bird in time. Bye, babe. Love you. Miss you. My lips are dry. <laughs> Greatest kiss I've ever, ever done. <laughs> Blah, what do you have to say? What's up, Link? You seem to be in a hurry. What's this about your bird? Oh, that unusual crimson loft, Link? Have I seen him? I'm sorry, I haven't. Why don't you look for him by the statue of the goddess? You'll have a good view of the whole town from way up there. And you guys, that huge statue in the north of... I know where the bird is. No more dilly-dallying. He's, um... He's over here. Look at this thing. Who knows how long this statue has been here. And it only has one eye, poor thing. Probably know this, but you can press forward to look around. Alright, cool. Oh, I don't have the sword. That's right, I remember now why I have to... Ah, oh, crap. To the goddess statue! Hey, Link! Over here! I have some information about your loft wing. Come over here. Oh, I know what it is, though. Where the hell are you? Thanks, Fledge. Hey, Link. I was just looking for you. Heard your loft wing has gone missing, so I thought I'd join in the search. And get this. When I asked Fledge what he knew, he started acting weird. I'm so sorry, Link. I really wanted to tell you, but if Groose found out, I told you. It sounds like Groose forced him to keep quiet about it. Go on, tell him the truth. Just a little while ago, when I was cleaning the dining hall, Groose and his buddies came in. They didn't notice I was there and started talking about their plan to hide your loft wing. <gasps> I wanted to warn you, Link, but just as I tried to sneak away, Bruce and his gang grabbed me. I said if I told you, they'd make sure I would never be able to ride a bird ever again. Sounds like Bruce and his buddies had a plan to capture your bird and hide him near a waterfall. Well, near a waterfall would mean... Quick, let's take a look at your map. I know where it is, but I need a sword. Uh, forgive me, Link. I can't help being such a coward. I'm really sorry. You're fine, man. Oh, oh one more thing, Link. Hmm? If you're going out to the waterfall, remember that there are some dangerous things there. Creepy, crawly things. You'll need to carry a sword. I think I saw the Knight Commander going to the sparring hall a while ago. You should ask him if you can borrow one. Um, that's right, I don't get the... Duh. I don't get the goddess sword until like a little bit later. Hello, sir. Ooh. Hey, it's Link! So you still want to get in some sword practice even though today is a wing ceremony? I'm impressed! Sword is in the back room. Go on back there and get it. I'll be here for a while, so if there's anything you don't understand about handling the sword, go ahead and ask. You got a practice sword. Thanks. Thanks, man. Oh, it holds about 300 rupees. Look at that. Look at it. Look at it. Mm -hmm. 
Oh yeah, you wanna learn how to how to use a sword? Uh yes, please. Cool. Hey, swordman. It's important to think about the direction you're swinging your sword. If you swing it vertically, you'll do a. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know how to do this. Wait, do I have to actually? That's right, Link. You really are a strong swordsman. Easy to teach, too. You make this instructor proud. Ready to try a spin attack? Heck yeah. We all I'm going to surround you with logs. I sure looked like it felt good. So, why don't you try a fatal blow to close our session? Sure. Amy is down. Ah, <laughs> nice. That's the way. A fatal blow is also an effective move to use right after you use your shield or a well-placed spin attack to knock an enemy on its back. Oh, but monsters don't stay down for long, so you'll have to land that fatal blow quick before they get up. Got it. Ow. Hey. Yeah. Actually hurting me. Hey. hey, Link! You can't take your swords outside of the sparring hall. What do you think you're doing sneaking out with that? I need it. What? Your loft wing is missing. You want to go look for it? Well, I guess I can make an exception just as once. Remember that Skyloft is a peaceful place. Only knights carry swords, so I don't want you to see you swinging around like clergy out there. I don't want to get in a ton of trouble over this, so here's the deal. Get a bunch of practice. Got it, got it, got it. All right, all right. Man, good lord. How long have I been recording for? Can't even see. An hour. Exactly an hour now, apparently. All right, child, what's your, what's your deal? What up, Link? Hey, hey, Link, can you help me with something? Well, all you have to do is dash and roll into the tree, just like I've been doing dash, and when you're in front of the tree, bam, do a roll right into it. So come on, please. That's not it. Whoa! You did it! A sky stag beetle! Wait up! Oh, rupees. Haha. <laughs> Yeah. 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 That's pretty cool. Blood sucking monsters, no kids allowed. Oh, I bet I have to go.
Just one rupee. Like I don't need to go that way. Oh wait, I thought I'm an idiot. I thought that ray of light was actually like a. then boys who dares challenge me master link ah small and nimble. I was able to turn around inside of that tiny little crevice. Come at me, bats. I want to do spin attack. Oh, boy, man. Doing black back flips. Doing black flips, spin attacks. What's the point of that? I mean, I guess it looks really cool, and it probably has more momentum. But, like, I feel like it's really unnecessary. Oh, hey! Link! 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 Hey, Link, I was hoping I'd find you here. Heard you'd gone searching for your bird around the waterfall, so I thought I'd fly around and help you look. How's your search going? Any sign of your loft wing? Hmm. Oh, no. Well, let's not lose hope yet. There's a place up ahead that Gruce and his gang are always hanging around. Maybe we'll find them there. Huh? Who? Who's that? Who's calling for me? Oh. Sorry, Link. I got distracted for a moment. Let's go. Are you coming with me? Oh, hey, baby. Hey, baby. What are you waiting around for, Link? Let's get your lost way. Oh, I'm just waiting for you to kiss me. Kiss me, baby. I like how he put it right next to a place where you can jump off. Look, there he is. No doubt about it. That's your loft wing, Link. Oh, wait. Dang. I 
Okay, there's nothing in there. Got you out, buddy. Don't even worry about it. I came to save you. We should hurry, Link. Now that your loft wing is free, you should fly to the ceremony. All right, the ceremony! But before you go, I have to ask you something. I heard this voice a few moments ago. Did you hear it too? It's been happening a lot lately. It's the strangest feeling, almost like someone is calling out to me. Have you ever wondered what's beneath the clouds? Some say that it's an empty, barren place or that there's nothing at all down below. But I just have this feeling that they're wrong. Some of Father's old texts talk about a place called the surface. The old tales describe a whole world under there, far more vast than Skylaw. The thing is, no one's ever been down there to see it, and our loft wings won't fly through the cloud barrier. But I can't help imagining the wild things that might be waiting below. Someday I want to see for myself. Oh, sorry, Link. We don't have time to talk. Let's get going. Look, your bird's waiting for you. Just leap off the edge and press down. Don't worry about falling. Your bird will catch you for sure this time. You got it, baby. Let's do this. <laughs> Woohoo! That would be so fun. Yeah! Okay, I'll do that. <laughs> Alright, here we go. <laughs> Woohoo! Yeah, yeah! Oh god, is it motion controlled? Oh, it's motion controlled. Oh god. Fly your bird in any direction when it's headed upward. It'll slowly lose speed. You want to speed up, direct your bird to gain upward to gain altitude. It'll drop into a fast dive. Oh my gosh. I forgot how difficult flying is in this game. So again, gain some altitude, then dive to speed up. Those are the basics of getting your bird up to top speed. How's he handling? Do you think he's flying all right? Uh, we're a little drunk. Can I not use motion controls? <laughs> okay, so it's all just this thing, so I don't have to worry about the left one. All right, that's kind of better to know then. hell do you gain more altitude after you've already like lost it like an idiot? Alright, dive. Come back up. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Dive. Oh, I can flap. How do I super do it? Woo
Gala for me. Even though it's like kind of hard. Well, that's a huge relief. I don't know about you, Link, but your Loftling looks like he's flying great. Yeah, I'm flying like a drunk freaking pigeon, man. My father and the others are probably worried about your bird, so let's go give them the good news. Your loft wing really is amazing, especially considering everything the poor guy's been through this morning. I'm going to fly back and tell father what happened. Can we start that thing? Ba -da -ba no. Whoa, whoa, whoa. If it isn't like... Word around the plaza is you found that dumb bird of yours. Well, that's just great. Because you and your dumb bird can't tell time. All the pre-race warm-ups me and the guys did were for nothing. Now I'm all stiff. We wait forever for the race to start. And they delay it for you? I don't get it. The big flake gets special treatment. <laughs> You're almost a man. You still can't seem to go anywhere without Zelda. I bet you can't even decide what to have for lunch on your own, huh? And don't think we haven't noticed the smug look. Ooh, Zelda and I are best friends. We go everywhere together. Oh. You think you're pretty suave, don't you? Well, don't you? Who's been going on forever about how he's going to be the one to be with Zelda? Grizz has been going on forever about how he's going to be the one to be with Zelda. He really got his pompadour and a ruffle about her. <laughs> Damn. I hate to break it to you, but today's the day I bust up this adorable little fantasy land you're living in. Zelda's playing the role that got us at today's ceremony, and I'm gonna be the one to claim that sailcloth. When I heard she made it herself, man, who was gonna wet some scrawny cloth clown snatch that prize from me? Oh yes, that sailcloth, Zelda's sailcloth, will be mine. <laughs> oh man. I bet she was thinking about me when she was stitching it. Yep, I can see it now. First I win the big race, and then Zelda and I finish the ceremony together in the statue. Just the two of us. We are a special moment alone. But it's stopping me and Zelda from having our moment. Oh, it's so real I can I can see it. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Behind you! Right behind you! What? Can't you see? Can't you two see I'm in the middle of... Oh! Uh -huh. Care to explain? Care to explain what you just meant by our special moment alone? <laughs> I, uh, nothing big really, just... Just Link. Yeah, I was just telling my buddy here I was glad he found that red bird of his... Boy, am I looking forward to a fair race. Anyhow, later, Zelda. Look for me during the race. I'll be the one pulling off all the dangerous moves. It's probably going to be me, because I have no idea how to fly this bird. Hey, Grizz, wait up! God, I hate their voices so much. Did you hear that guy? A fair race? Yeah, the chances of that happening are just about less than zero. Either way, don't let those fools get you down, Link. Just get out there and fly the best you can. I know you've got these guys beat, and deep down, I think you do too. Us? Alone? Yeah. That's the spirit, Link. Trust me, you can win this. The wing ceremony will now begin. Wait, the wing ceremony will now begin. Participating students, please assemble. Looks like it's time to race. Good luck, Link. Oh, are we just going? That's a cool looking little bird. Hey! Your attention, please! At last, we are ready to begin the wing ceremony. I was beginning to worry that we'd proceed without Link, but luckily there is no longer a concern. I'm glad you all could make it. 
before we start, I'll explain the rules for today's competition. I don't remember what voice I had for him. I'll, I'll never remember, because I, I don't remember who people are, ever. I have attached a small statuette to this bird, who I will then release to the skies. On my signal, dash from the starting line and dive off the ledge. Once you are in the air, mount your loft wing. Remember to call your bird promptly with blank once you dive off the edge. Whoever catches the bird and claims the statuette will be this year's champion. Those are the rules. Simple enough, I should think, but you need to hear them again. No! Excellent. As you well know, today's champion will graduate to the next class, bringing him one step closer to knighthood. He will receive a gift from the young woman chosen to play the role of the goddess in this year's ritual. Today is a special day for many reasons, but it is also the 25th anniversary of our fine institution. To celebrate the occasion, today's champion shall also receive his gift at high atop the statue of the goddess. Here, the young woman performing the role of the goddess this year has crafted the gift herself. And as you all well know, the role of the goddess this year will be performed by <laughs> the lovely Zelda. <laughs> Let's see your finest flying out there. Show me just how hard you've been practicing. Also, I want to see a good, clean flying. Anyone caught interfering with other riders will answer to me. Cool. That goes double. That goes double for you, Goose. All right, gentlemen, line up at my command. The competition will begin. I hate to do this to you all, but thank everybody so much for watching. If you want to see more, please make sure to leave a like, comment, tell me what you guys think down in the comments below. And I will see all you 11 people in the next video where we will finish this race and kick some ass. Anyway, sword slashes all around. I will see all you 11 people. Dang it, I just barely didn't make it. I will see all you next people. I, I will see all you 11 people in the next video. Bye bye <laughs> Hope you like cliffhangers.